What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Fred and today I'm gonna to be going through and sampling one of my favorite artists of all time, which is The Weeknd. I'm gonna be sampling one of his newer singles called uh, Heartless and I don't really know which direction I'm gonna take it, but um, I'm gonna take you guys along that journey here. But yeah, if we can get this video to 2,000 likes, um, I will send a bunch of commenters my uh, upcoming kit. Yeah, you guys got the video to 2,000 likes last time, so I dropped a free uh, sample pack in the description. Um, I'm still not finished with that at the recording of this, but when the vi this video, <coughs> When this video drops, that'll be down there in the description below. Just a whole bunch of video game samples for you guys. So uh, yeah, let's jump into the video. My uh, my main thing here is I'm not trying to get demonetized. So I'm going to show you guys, as you can see on the screen here, I got Heartless pulled up and um, I just YouTubed the MP3 that with this converter and I brought it in. If I play anything in here, I'll get demonetized. It'll, it'll copyright the video right away. So there's a part over here that I'm just going to, I'm going to uh, loop here and then take out and sample and you guys are going to be able to see that. I'm just going to pitch it up so that hopefully I don't get demonetized. Probably still will anyway. Anyway, but I'll be right back. You guys will see it. All right, so I got this little part pulled up here. I'm just going to uh, drop it down to like, let's say 125. And I'm going to stretch this to match here. Now it's going to be sped up. And I'm going to just pitch it up like 300 uh, semitones. And hopefully I don't get demonetized for playing this, but this part of the video. So let's hear how it sounds. Um, I like the way that sounds here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to just start processing it here. Take out some of the low end. That sounds cool. I'm going to use portal and kind of uh, get like a little some type of effect going that I like. We'll see. Turn that down a little bit. Now I'm gonna add some RC20. And what this is gonna do is give it a little bit more of a like vintage aesthetic kind of feel. I'm gonna turn up the noise a little bit. Leave this the way it is. I'm gonna widen this. Add a little bit of space. Take down the decay. For the distortion, let's do some like air. Sounds pretty solid. I want a little bit of delay in here as well, so I'm gonna go into effect rack and uh, start messing with some delays, see what sounds good. Okay, that sounds pretty sick so far. So I'm gonna take this here off rip. I'm just gonna unique this and pitch this down one octave from where it is. So if it's up 300, 1200 semitones is one octave. Quick maths, that's negative 900 semitones. This should sound good. You can hear the difference here. And then here, I just want to make sure it's not too loud. I'm going to widen it just a little bit. I want to add another melody. I don't want this to be like the only melody. So I'll open up some arcade and see kind of what goes. Definitely a minor. Go into like vintage synths to the stars and see if... So it sounds kind of cool. Sounds kind of cool. Uh, that's a lot of delay on the arcade. It's still going, jeez. Turn that off. Maybe pitch it down uh, an octave. Sounds kind of good right there. Sounds pretty hard, I like that. Let's start processing this a little bit more. Take out a little bit more of the high. I want this to kind of be the main part of the track.
Sounds pretty good. What up? I'm filming. You're filming? Yeah, I'm filming. Uh, You're ruining my video. Uh, Can I say hi? Yeah, come say hi, bro. Fuck! Fuck! I'm are, saying you, are, you, are you on live right now? No, I'm not on live. I'm filming something, though. I'm remixing Heartless by the uh, I'm remixing Heartless by the weekend. That song I keep oh, replaying. Dude, that's fire. Yeah, but I'll show you it after because you All can't right. hear because my headphones. All right. See ya. Later. Bowdy. Add a little bit of RC20 in this. Not a lot though. I want to actually take everything down a little bit. Widen this for sure. That sounds hard. I like that a lot. Let's get some drums going. Actually, no, nah, I don't want to go with that. Go to somewhere else. We got some stuff here. Make this easier. I want to keep this video shorter. Go for some more. Just see if something one of these sound good. Oh my God, I just want something with like this consistent pattern. Add a little bit of reverb to these uh, hi-hats. <laughs> and then get started on the uh, 808. Got <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Probably want to use this at some point. Alright, cool. Alright, now basically everything else is arranging and that's going to be a big part of this is definitely the arrangement and kind of change the sample here and there and you'll see. We'll do it right now. Go here, right click, click split by channel, bring all this in. I have an idea kind of how I want this to lead in. Let's go like that, have it lead in like this, have that over here somewhere. And two. All right, so I'm gonna automate this uh, arcade here in the intro. Just take out all the high. Yeah, like I said, automate that and have that come in like here so that it builds up here.
I'm just gonna have this come in right there in the beginning. This way, I wanna kind of control this a little bit more, but this way I uh, can have control and then this will make it sound more seamless as it comes in with the transition. <laughs> I think for right here, what I'll do is I'll add a uh, Moog bass. Actually, I know exactly which one I want to use here. Growler bass, it's called. I am sweating. I am. Uh, it's hot in here. My God. Why do I have a jacket on? I'm stupid. Growler. I don't know why I growled that too. Um, for this, I'll just copy paste the this pattern here and then tweak it from there. Lengthen everything. It's gonna be way too loud. Bring these down. Take these out. Lengthen them. Yeah, that didn't work. Like, no. I uh, lengthen that by doing control L. Add this in here. I'll pitch this down too. It's super loud. I know what we're gonna do though. Add this glide here. The only way the glide's actually gonna work is if you have all these like that. And then actually from here, what I want to do is add a gross beat. That way I can gate it a little bit. Don't laugh. I don't own gross beat, so it's going to give me a message. Boy, if you don't We're going to give it a little bit of our own thing here. We're going to do that by doing this, delete this, and then kind of tweak it from here. I like that. Sounds pretty good. And then Let's give it a little bit of that like kind of like like pulse effect. And then it'll all just come right back in at the end there. Everything come out and then all the beat comes back in at the end. Then have it uh do that again over there. thing here is just add my tag in perfect and then we got ourselves a weekend banger kind of flipping flippy didgeridoo i am i am i'm sweating my ac's on like 65 and it ain't doing shit for me right now perfect I need a little bit more transitions here because it changes so much with the high pitch and the low pitch. But here we go. We got the full beat here. So I hope everybody enjoyed the video. Um, I'll let this thing play out here at the end. Um, if you did like the video, drop a like, subscribe, follow me on IG at BCXCY. Let me know what contact you want next. Um, <clears throat> yeah, peace.